So one big feature about Windows 10 that a lot of people don't know about it or never got across of it is having the ability to share your smartphone screen to PC. I'm gonna move in a second to my laptop and show you and how this works. You don't really need any third-party applications. It's all the default settings. Of course, if your phone has the ability to share the screen. This feature many people want to share to TVs, but not all TVs have this feature, but well, PCs have this feature. All the laptops with Windows 10 has this ability, but if you have a PC desktop like me, then I don't have a wireless connection. So this feature works through wireless. And to work on my PC, I need this kind of adapter, uh, which this adapter has like Bluetooth and also wireless. And my phone can see this adapter. I get the pop-up on PC to enable the connection, everything fine, but then nothing happens. So maybe this my adapter is not really working correctly because uh, the connection is there, but then nothing happens. Or maybe my phone can't really work with this adapter. Uh, so when I switch to my laptop, well, through my laptop works fine. My laptop has two frequencies. 2.4 gigahertz which is the older one and 5 gigahertz which is the newer one so 5 gigahertz of course is the is the faster one but then my phone has only 2.4 gigahertz so the experience is not really that smooth when you switch between menus you will see in a second that the experience is not really that smooth so maybe a newer phone with the newer frequency 5 gigahertz might work perfectly without any problem if you guys have any phone uh, with 5 gigahertz or even 2.4 gigahertz try it and let me know uh, in the comments if it worked for you because well for me uh, it works but it, the experience it's not that smooth but well let's jump to the laptop and show you how it works so into your pc when you open the notification center you have here connect well for me it's at the bottom for you might be somewhere else press on the connect button and then you have here projecting to this PC. Once you click on it, you have these options. So to enable, for you, it might be always off. Uh, you can enable available uh, everywhere on secure networks. I just enable everywhere and then ask to project to this PC first time only or every time a connection is required. I let it every time a connection is required. And also if my laptop now is on uh, battery only, you need to disable this option if your laptop is on battery only because this option is this PC can be discovered for projection only when it is plugged in so my now it's on only battery and now on your phone open the notification center and for me i have it here mirror share for you it might be another name if you use a huawei device uh, and you don't see it here then come here edit and then you might have here at the bottom and then drag it up it this is for huawei devices or even if you don't find it try to go into settings and try to type uh, mirror for me it's mirror share for you it might be cast so just try mirror share or cast and now uh, if I press on Mirror Share, it will search for dev for available devices. Desktop, and it changed on that desktop as well, and it connected it. So as you can see, I have the same image as here and there. Uh, the experience might not be like, it, as you see, it's not 100% smooth. It does the job, and if you watch some video, the audio it will be on your PC. But like I've said, uh, I if I watch a video, then the audio will be very stuttery because as you see, the sharing is not really that perfect. But yeah, this is how it works, guys. And don't forget to let me know in the comments uh, if it worked for you and if it's working smooth or not. Thank you guys for watching. See you on the next one.